Hi. Now in this question, we're asked to simplify then x minus 5 multiplied by x squared plus 3. And from this, we subtract x plus 4 multiplied by x minus 1. So I'd copy down the question and I'd write that this is not equal to, but identical to what I'm going to write here. And to expand this, we take x and we multiply it by each of these two terms, and then we just do minus 5 multiplied by each of the two terms. So x times x squared is going to be x cubed, and then we've got x times plus 3, which is plus 3x. And then we do minus 5 times x squared, which is minus 5x squared, and then minus 5 times the plus 3, which is going to be minus 15. Now for the next term, we've got minus 1 times this term here. So it's important then just to think of this as minus and put a bracket here, even though we're expanding these two. So we've got x times x, which is x squared. And then we've got x times minus 1, which is minus x. 4 times x, which is 4x and then 4 times minus 1, which is minus 4. Now, this is going to be identical to then, well, we've got four terms here. We can't clean up any of those terms, so we'll just copy them back in. x cubed plus 3x, then minus 5x squared minus 15. And then for this one, well, we've got minus 1 times each of these terms here. So that's going to effectively change the sign of each one. We're going to get minus x squared, then we're going to get plus x, and then minus 4x, and then plus 4. So that's why it's important to have that bracket there, okay, and just not expand this in the first instance. Okay, so let's just tidy this up now. So this is identical to, and if we write it in descending powers, we've got x cubed as the highest power there. And then x squared terms, we've got minus 5x squared minus another x squared, so that's minus 6x squared. Next for x terms, we've got plus 3x and then plus another x is 4x, and then we take away 4x, so there's going to be no x term there. For the constants, we've got minus 15, and then plus 4, which is going to be minus 11. Okay, so it's written in descending powers. You didn't have to write it in descending powers, but it does look better, because the first term is a positive term. Okay, 